Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having the best day ever. If this is your first time on my channel, my name is Sebastian. I welcome you guys with open arms. I do tea videos, vlogs, story times, pop culture, weight loss. Bitch, we have a lot of fun on this channel. So make sure you hit that subscribe button. You do not want to, you won't regret it, bitch. I can't talk. Anyways, you guys, welcome back to my channel. So I just watched Jeffree Star's new video saying, Goodbye. So, um, let's talk about it. But before, if you have not yet subscribed, did I already ask if you subscribed? I have no idea. But if I didn't, please subscribe. And if I did, please subscribe. Okay, so listen. Jeffree Star says goodbye. So the video, the clickbait of it all is incredible. Um, you know, I honestly thought when I first saw, like, the little thing that popped up in my, um, you see, here I was. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Here I was. I was trying to do a TikTok dance because now she's a TikToker, bitch. I'm going through something, obviously. But uh, I was trying to do a dance because I'm trying to incorporate a little more exercise in my life. So I was like, you know what? Let me learn some dances. Because back in the day, bitch, I, I thought I was Britney Spears, honey. I was doing all these choreographies, these routines in my room, bitch. I would cut up a shirt. I would put it on my head. It was like hair. And I was like, I, you would have, bitch, you... I thought I was on tour, bitch. I had a tour manager, a backup dancers, assistants. I was Britney Spears, bitch, okay? <laughs> so I was trying to do some TikTok dances, trying to incorporate a little more, you know, and then I saw saying goodbye and I was like, what, bitch? So I sat down, I was like, oh my God, he's leaving YouTube, his factory burnt, like, what is happening? You know what I mean? He's finally giving up and putting the wigs away and going back to Wyoming, bitch, I have no idea. So, I watched the video on, on speed. I put the fastest speed possible because, bitch, I was like, girl, <gasps> no. Well, basically, he's just saying that his camera guy, Chris, left the building. He has quit after so many years. Um, he says that uh, he has his own projects and he's from England so that he hasn't seen his family in a very long time. So, that's why he hasn't been uploading videos because he doesn't have a camera guy. He also says that his personal assistant, Mandy, also quit um and left to do her own thing um he talks very highly on both of them you know he says that there's no drama there's no tea there's no nothing uh but that they are no longer with him and that's why it's been hard for him to film but i'm just like look i'm not trying to shade anyone but like can you just like turn on the camera and put some makeup on you know what i mean like he was your camera guy not your i mean i i, I guess i understand that there's like this higher level because here i am bitch sweating you know no makeup like whatever in my raw shirt making a video but i of course i guess when you're that level it's bigger but i feel like at the same time his fans would appreciate a more humble jeffrey you know seeing him in this video i i even noticed that he was a little more you know he was a little more uh real like he was he wasn't this perfect robot that he tries so desperately to be um he was like you know bitch he needed his inhaler honey he was out of breath bitch you know they say that chubby people are always out of breath bitch he was out of breath too okay but you know i'm thinking like you know he was a little more real and i think his fans now i mean listen we're never going to get major sincere apologies from jeffrey but you know i guess for his fans and for the people who still support his makeup brand they would really appreciate to see a little more humbleness i guess so him recording like oh girl can you imagine him recording like a makeup review filmed by himself you know what i mean i honestly feel like people would really find it kind of cute and humbling i think or his fans at least not the people who don't like him but his fans at least will definitely find it you know more humble like more real you know what i mean but anyways i don't know bitch that's just my opinion i just noticed i still have the tags on my ross shirt look how much this shirt was this was 7.99 bitch if you don't know about ross honey get on it ross is amazing but anyways you guys yeah so his whole team is like saying bye but I also, he also talks about how when, you know, he's uprooting his life to Wyoming to be with Kanye, allegedly. No, I'm just kidding. But, you know, he's relocating to Wyoming. So, um, you know, he, his, like, people around him, they cannot obviously up and, you know, go and re relocate their life. But here, you know what, you guys, I don't know if I'm like, the, if you're like me, but I've always... Oh, so I always talk, I always think about people's like celebrities' finances. And I'm like, I understand, you know, Jeffree Star, he, he talks a lot about in, in, um, 
um, investments and stuff. So I, I think he's smart with his money, but I also feel like he spent so much money and it sort of like makes me like stressed. I'm like, girl, what if like less and less people stop buying his makeup and you know, like what if he goes broke? Like, I don't know. It's just like the thought I had the other day. I was like, oh my God, girl, slow down with the spending because like his launches don't seem as big as they once were, you know? And honestly, it takes one more scandal and I really truly think Jeffrey is done. But anyways, you guys. <sighs> I'm bored. <sighs> What's next? That was shady, but I did have to yawn. But anyways, you guys, let's listen. If you are a Jeffree Star fan, there's no judgments on this channel, bitch. You know, I don't judge anybody, honey. Listen, we are all friends, bitch, okay? Let's just pretend we're all on a couch with a pillow over our tummies and we're having snacks and, you know, we're just fucking watching That's So Raven, bitch, or Lizzie McGuire movie. I don't know, bitch. I had the biggest crush on Gordo. Did you guys? I don't know, but this is our dreams. Our may I hate when Lizzie does this in the movie. This is what dreams, dreams. This is what, you know when she does like this and they show her from the back, I'm like, girl, that wig! <sighs> Anyways, you guys, are you excited to see more Jeffree Star um, thing? Can you imagine working for him? He did talk about how he's going to hire a new personal assistant, new camera guy, um, but can you imagine working for him? Oh, I did see that they, he commented down below. Somebody asked like, how much does your camera guy get? And he was like, every employee of mine makes amazing money or something like that, like gets paid really good and have benefits. I believe that. I believe that he pays good. You know what I mean? He doesn't, for me, he doesn't look like someone who's cheap with his things. You know what I mean? And I that includes his employees because, honey, the T is a lot of these YouTubers are cheap as fuck to their employees. I don't know, bitch. That's just the word on the street, okay? And I live in LA, so I hear things. But anyways, you guys. Here, you know what? Let's do a little karaoke. Hey, Google, play This Is What Dreams Are Made Of karaoke. I'm gonna get my microphone. Hey Google, play This Is What Dreams Are Made Of karaoke. You guys ready? You guys like my... What Dreams Are Made Of, originally performed by Hilary Duff. Here we go. Karaoke version by Hiptoons Karaoke. Okay, sure. You guys ready? Playing on YouTube music. I'm, I'm hey now, hey now. Have you ever seen such a beautiful night? Sing to me, Paolo. I could almost kiss the stars for shining so bright. When I see you smiling, I go, oh, oh, oh. I would never want to miss this. Cause in my heart, I know what this is. Hey now, this is what dreams are made of. Paolo, come back here. Hey now, this is what dreams are made of. Hey Google, somewhere I belong. I've got somebody to love. This is what dreams are made of. Hey Google, stop. Hey, Google, stop. Whatever happened to Miranda? You know she got excited when they announced that Lizzie McGuire reboot and then they didn't. But anyways, you guys, I hope you enjoyed this messy fucking video. I love you guys so much. Have a beautiful day. And I hope to see you in the next video. Subscribe and have a beautiful day. Mwah.